to sing. I got the guitar tuned down a half a step and then and, and cut it. The, uh, the bridge is really way too high for me. I <laughs> probably needed to tune it down another half. Maybe a full staff. Maybe a full staff. Maybe that would have made it. I don't know. Not sure. Okay, well, the, uh, obviously the Moody Blues, uh, this, had, you know, this was a big hit for them in 1986. Kind of on their comeback, you know, from the, uh, uh, all of the hits that they had in the 70s. Uh, not horribly complex, like I said, a little tough to, to sing. Uh, we start out with a little intro, and I would be using a four-finger G, and then the four-finger C, or the C9, uh, obviously thumb on the big E string when you hit the C. And then we go to a D, and then a D7. And that's a little bit. It's a little bit tricky because it's kind of fast. It happens on one line. So let's uh, let's just run through the uh, the intro real quick. One more time. So we're gonna have. On a time I go to C Once when you were D Mine This is the quick change on one word Back to the G I remember C Sky or C9 Reflected in your D Eyes D7 Eyes Now one thing about the D7 form You already have your This second finger is in the right spot for the F so you don't need to move all your fingers to find the F. You can use this as your anchor. Obviously, this is a bar. These two fingers come over if you're going to do an F, an F bar chord like I did. I wonder where you are. And here I stick with bar chords. I go to a C. Wonder where you are because I have to go back to an F again. When I'm in bar chords, I kind of like to stick with bar chords. Then I slide back down and went right into my F again. I wonder if you see. Think about me. And then back to a G. Once upon a time in your wild D, D7 dream, see you, D, D7. Okay, so there's three verses, they're all exactly the same. Then when we get into the bridge, this is when it's a little bit tough for the voice. It starts with, oh, so we're coming off that D7 again. And when the music plays, when, and this one way goes up, when the words hit, see, touch with sorrow, gee, when the music plays, see, I hear the sound, I see, had to follow, 
Once upon a time, D7. And then we're going to go back into another verse, again, uh, exactly the same, uh, the G, C, D, D7, and then the F, C, F. And then, then there's a, another a verse that is uh, kind of a, they're, they're not really singing, they're doing the ah, ah, ah thing. Then they repeat the bridge, and then repeat, uh, this is how the song gets long. Then you repeat the first verse again, and then we end on a, a G, ah, C. And then this song is one of those fade out ones because we only had two minutes and 30 seconds or something shorter than the song was. And we and you have because you're on a D, we need to resolve on G because that's what we, we started with. Okay, we bring it back to the beginning. Okay, so uh, let's check out the strumming pattern to see if there's much of a one here. up and down there's nothing there's nothing fan, no fancy strumming in here at all uh, so that's pretty you know that's pretty much it uh, we got fairly simple chords we're probably in the C uh, in the key of C because we got that F in there right if it was in the key of G you wouldn't have you would generally you're not gonna have an F in there uh, so that parts fairly straightforward singing's a little bit tough and uh, but I think that pretty much uh, pretty much does it. Moody Blues, Your Wildest Dreams, 1986, of course, a big hit for them. Hope you got something out of this lesson. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time out there.